What's up guys, everything Apple Pro here, and today we're going to be telling some things that are bad about the iPhone 4. Almost everything is bad about the iPhone 4, but whenever it came out, it was a very good phone, but now compared to the 6 Plus, eh, I don't, I don't want to tell, I don't want to talk about it. So, um, we're here around my office space, sort of, slash something, so we're going to be selling, um, we're going to be telling some bad stuff about the iPhone 4. I don't know if this is the 4S or the 4, I'm not sure, probably the 4S, but, um, yeah, um, first thing on the list, let's go ahead and get straight to it, first thing on the list is the back of it, the back of it is made out of glass, so whenever you drop it, like, kabam, on concrete, it's gonna shatter, so it's just asking to get dropped, and, um, the front glass is only Gorilla Glass 3, so, I mean, Gorilla Glass 3, so it's not that it's not the best out there, so there's better options. So, um, the third thing, speed-wise, watch. Yeah, that's that's pretty bad. Compared to the device that I am recording with right now, it's pretty bad. But yeah, um, so, let's turn this guy on again. So, watch. So, speed-wise, it's pretty bad. Yeah, um, even whenever we try to turn it off. Yeah, it's... it's it even has that like that after blast. Like, just see like that, that, like that little light. See whenever it goes off. So yeah, there's that, guys. So the iPhone 4, I would not suggest buying it unless you you like something that's simple, that's slow, and yeah, and you're an old lady. Okay, sorry. Um, so um, yeah, basically, it only it does not have Siri as voice control. If that'll ever come up. Yeah, it has hello voice control. Okay, so it does not have Siri. But if you guys did not know, the first device ever to have Siri on it was the iPhone 5. Um, and then it goes along to the 5C, the 5S, and then the 6, and then the 6S, and the 6 Plus, and yeah, hopefully we'll get a 7. But yeah, guys, um, this phone it looks awesome. I I, I cannot say this looks bad, but it looks awesome. And you think that camera wouldn't stick out. It does stick out. You wouldn't notice it, but it does stick out. Like, if you're on a flat surface, it does not wobble, but it is, um, it is, it is not, like, flat onto the, um, like, the device. I mean, it's, it's not really a problem. It's not as bad as, like, the 6, where it's, like, sticking out, sticking out, but it's, it's, it, it'll, it's enough to scratch your camera, but that's not really a problem. And the other thing, there's one complaint about the about the design on the device. Right here, th those words, it's just, it, it looks so bad. And, again, and uh, another thing I have to complain about, and Apple has really have to fix this. I don't know if they have yet, but if you guys have noticed, um... You know how iPhones are supposed to like stand up on the sides? Well, you see how the volume rockers are actually coming out quite a bit? It just barely stays there and on the top, it's, it just falls over. So, um, yeah, and the front facing camera, it's only a four megapixel. That's pretty bad. And um, the back facing camera is, um, I'm not too sure. I'll look that up online later. But, yeah, and I've just made a Minecraft video, see? Like, on the Xbox 360, and there's my lava lamp. And it is going again. My lava lamp is going again. So, let's get to the point of this video again. And, um, all of the apps on your phone, you will notice after time, whenever you download apps, they will get even slower every single day. Because I have realized, um, it has, this device has gotten slower every single day. So, yeah, and that happens on, um, not all the iPhones. It happens, I think, on the 5. And, guys, you will notice that this phone will get really, really hot if you, like, watch YouTube videos, if you play games, if you, like, talk on the phone for a long time, and even if you plug it up, it will get very hot. It's just like the HTC One M9. It'll get very, very hot. But you think it wouldn't because the glass... It, it like it's it's not like something that would get really really hot, but the um uh I don't know, wait what what's on the HTC M 
I mean, the HTC One M9. It's um, isn't it made out of um? It's made out of aluminum. Yeah. Um, it's made out of sort of a metal. And yeah, guys, another thing that is very annoying. Whenever you stick your phone in your pocket, you're gonna notice that there's this button right here on the side. And if I press that, it cuts your ringer off. And this has happened very, very, very many times to my uh, nanny that has used this phone. Um, it's happened to her many, many times. Whenever she slips it in her pocket like that, it just turns her ringer off, and well, you're not gonna be able to hear your phone. Um, so basically, it, Apple has brought a lot of good features. Well, they say they're good features. And guess what they've added to the iPhone 6? 10 selfies in a second. Yeah. And uh, once again, what we were talking about earlier, this this is supposed to be like a quick feature to like get to your um, like arena if you're at the movies or something, which I've went recently. You just take it and go. But it's not that much quicker. All you have to do is just take it and go. I mean, you just unlock it. Is this even oh, yeah. Just take it and turn that volume all the way down. But that's okay. Um, and then another bad thing about this phone, you can only get one in 32 gigabytes. You cannot get one higher than that. The 6 Plus, you can get 126 gigabytes. Yeah. So, another bad feature about this. Again, uh, it's about, like... The sides and stuff whenever you get to daily like usage you will see that your device is getting like really 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 hard on the sides and it's getting really really dented up and the reason for that is because it's made out of the same thing that the um, iPhone 6 plus and the 6 and the 5 uh, well not no not the 6 and the 6 plus only the 5 does this but yeah that that side it whenever you drop it right scrape it along it gets oh yeah that got scratched up more but yeah and another thing that I really don't like about this device and something that I don't even like about the 6 but this does not take it all the way so it doesn't really bother me that much but look that little black line now I don't know what this is but it's just like a little thing but and it's at the tops too I don't know why that's there but it, it just it's weird and even if they did do that they should at least like make it like the 6 was. I can understand they can't because the camera is in the way. Because on the 6, it goes all the way across the backs. So yeah. Not a bad feature. And another bad feature is the home button. It's very, very loud. Well, it's not that loud. It's just very loud. And another bad feature about this phone. The flashlight is not very bright at all. I mean, not at all, but... That's okay, I guess. Um, and the FaceTime app, it is the slowest app on your device. It doesn't matter how new, how old it is, it's the slowest app on your device. Watch. Look how long that takes. Well, no, 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 it's not. The app store is actually because it takes so long to like, watch this. Watch for all the stuff that pop up. Did you see how long that took? Yeah, I mean, that's just... Back in the day, I don't see how you would even handle something like that. I mean, it would just be so horrible to have something that slow. I mean, I can understand, like, my iPod Touch. I lost it a long time ago, but... I mean, it was probably... Uh, it's, it's showing amazing apps for iPhone. Well, it was. No, it's not. But as I was saying before, guys, don't buy the iPhone 4S. It'll be horrible. I mean, it looks awesome. Except for, like, these little things, like I told you about earlier. Well, other than that, it's... That's not that bad. Another bad thing. Apple, what what are you doing? Why did you do this? You put the headphone... You put the speaker... Whenever you're playing games, like... Um, for instance, Candy, Candy Crush Soda. Let's just load that real quick. And if you like the screen to, like, be like this... You're putting it in your hand like this, you can see your hands actually cover it. So, if you like to play like this, it's just not going to go so well because it. And on every single generation iPhone, this has been there. It's just on the bottom. The phone that I'm recording with right now has it up there at the top where the camera is, 
But, yeah. And look how long. No, never mind. The Candy Crush app is the slowest app in the game. I mean, in your iPhone. So, I'm just going to go ahead and click on the app. Candy Crush Soda. If you download it, it's going to be super slow. Watch this. It probably won't even. It might load. This is worse than 3G. And you know how the 3G is. So, yeah. I would rather buy, like any other generation iPhone except for like the 2G but yeah um and you saw how long that took to load um guys I hope you enjoyed this video um it wasn't really a count of things it's probably about like maybe 15 things probably about 10 but yeah that was 10 things that is wrong with your iPhone for um guys I hope you enjoyed this video like and subscribe.